Today on Poor Choice, where we normally drink the worst liquor on the planet every week, we're actually going to cover hangover cures because I've got one. I, I have a hangover from doing research for the show. Curing a hangover is tricky. Uh, a hangover takes a long time to create, and you can't just make it disappear when it suits you like your relationship status on Facebook. There are a lot of ideas out there about how to get rid of a hangover, and we're going to examine a few. Medicine doesn't cure anything. There's no money in it. If the drug companies had a line on how to fix a hangover, they would string you out on a daily medication that came with a warning not to mix with alcohol. I have a hangover, not a crossbow injury. So I'm not in pain. I'm not using this. Pain relievers are for people that buy four-wheel drive vehicles and still slow down for speed bumps. The little energy drink bottles, they come in different flavors, grape, berry, orange, no mint. I think mint would be a top seller, especially if you're still drunk and you have to go into work and you don't want to let your boss know how little you've read about the substance abuse policy in the company handbook. These little energy drink bottles last for different periods of time, five hours, six hours, which one do you want? How about the one that gives me the last 24 hours of my life back? I've made some mistakes that might be above this bottle's pay grade. Well, I still have a hangover, but now I have more energy to complain about it. Drink plenty of water. Thanks, Doc. This is the kind of Nobel Prize winning forward thinking by the fine folks who gave us it is what it is and the be careful warning right after you trip on a curb. Drink plenty of water. Why don't you drink plenty of bleach? Last night I went to plenty of bars, drank plenty of booze, and got into plenty of trouble. So I'm not sure plenty is the right solution for me. Pickle juice sounds like trucker slang for what hitchhikers have to swallow in order to get to the next town. However, the salt and the vinegar in the pickle juice, it helps your body start replacing the water you lost by drinking. They say it's best to drink this before you go to sleep and actually have pickle juice. If you don't, you should probably catch a ride home from Uber Eats. <laughs> It isn't working, but I think I can now clean my smartphone screen with my tongue. When you eat something spicy for a hangover, the idea is to burn the evil out of you. And that seems to me like the beta version of Leech's 2.0. The discomfort you get from something spicy hot doesn't cure your hangover. It distracts you from being hungover. Now you're pale and sweaty, and everyone thinks you're going to steal their flat screen TV to support your heroin habit. Then you have two problems when the spicy calms down. So I'm not doing this one either. Hair the dog. Drinking more alcohol to cure your hangover. In reality, hair of the dog doesn't fix the problem, it just delays it. And in reality, this is precisely why we drink liquor in the first place, delaying reality. Hangovers are fun, leaving the body. And when you choose to drink more alcohol, the morning after a night of drinking, you're actually injecting fun back into the body. As for eating breakfast, a big meal just slows you down. And it requires a refrigerator full of ingredients that I just don't have. You know what I have in my refrigerator? pickle juice, and leftover terrible booze from recording a bunch of Poor Choice episodes. So I'm going to just combine these two and attempt to make a Titan cure with the blueberry pancake liqueur and the maple bacon moonshine I drank in previous episodes. What's the, uh, the rhyme here? Clear liquor first and your insides will burst. 
No. Start with brown and you're going down? No help. No matter which way I'm going to choose, I am going to lose. Yeah! Johnny MC can spit! That's hip-hop lingo. It's also poor choice lingo because I'm probably spitting this out in a few minutes. Uh, uh, this is not getting me anywhere. It's time for drastic action. I'm John McClellan. This has been Poor Choice. I'm going back to bed. <laughs>